Oh shit. <laughs> There's a lot of people not gonna like this video. <laughs> All right, this week's blogging question is, Matt, what do you think the best blog sites are to make money with? There's so many free sites out there. Can I just use one of these and hop on the band wagon and start making some dough? <laughs> I love your question, I love your personality. I don't think you're gonna like my answer. The best blog sites to make money with is basically your question. A lot of people have these big long lists of like the top 10 blog sites, blogging sites that you can make money with. This is all bullshit, man. The only blogging site that you're gonna make a substantial amount of money with is your own. You know why? Because if I was a company that was giving out free blogging sites, you best believe I'm gonna make money on your ass in order to cover the hosting fees and all the other expenses that are associated with giving you that platform. You guys think that you know all these sites out there are just giving you free places to write and express your thoughts and blah, blah, blah. You're either blinded by the light or you don't really see what's going on. They're gonna run their own ads, they're gonna monetize your thoughts, you're gonna do all the work and they're gonna collect all the profits. There's only one blog site that you should be writing on to make money. If you just want to express your thoughts or you just want a hobby blog or you just want to do this or have your little corner of the internet, then okay, fine, go use a free blog hosting site. There's a shitload of them out there. Blogger is one of them. You could do Tumblr, you could do Medium, whatever. But you got to realize what you're doing. You're building an asset you're putting effort into something for someone else, for another large company, for a corporate organization that doesn't give a fuck about you. So you specifically said, I wanna make money. What are the best blog sites to make money? There's only one, self-hosted WordPress. You see, well, you can't see it right now, but my blog, cleverleverage.com, is a self-hosted WordPress blog. I make over six figures a year from that blog by itself. And I know a shitload of people that do the exact same thing. And you know what all of them have in common? Every six figure blogger that I know, they all run self-hosted WordPress just like I do. And you know what I would do if I were starting a blog over today and I wanted to make money with it? I would only use self-hosted WordPress. Now, a lot of people are confused by that because WordPress.com offers you know, paid WordPress hosting and you get your domain name and you can configure this and that. That's not it. You want WordPress.org Actually, I wouldn't even go to WordPress. If you wanna set up the right kind of blog, watch my tutorials in the YouTube description or use Bluehost and SiteGround. It's like three or $4 a month if you pay 12 months up front. There's discount codes for all my readers in the YouTube description for both companies. If you want, if you're a beginner and you're gonna need tech handholding and you're not sure how to do stuff and you might need help over the phone, use Bluehost because they have better native English speaking support. If you want something that's a little bit faster, you're pretty tech savvy, you don't have a lot of questions and you're okay with um, email tech support, use SiteGround. Coupon codes for both in the YouTube description. Use those links that'll automatically be applied to your, excuse me, account. Now, why is this the case? Why is this? <clears throat> because usually it's a scam. When you ask a question and somebody tells you there's only one way to do something, most of the time it's a scam. If it wasn't, then Home Depot wouldn't exist across the street from Lowe's, or Lowe's wouldn't exist across the street from Home Depot. You know, Costco and Sam's wouldn't be across the street from each other, right? Like there's usually two to three ways to do something. There's two or three companies that'll work well. And to answer your question very specifically, there are two or three options <clears throat> for a self-hosted WordPress blog that you could use to make money with. The reason that I'm saying there's only one is because self-hosted WordPress, WordPress as a CMS management platform, is just a free open source uh, content manager or website manager. Something that gives you the ability to drag and drop so you don't have to know code to publish you know, words on a page. You don't have to learn HTML to use WordPress. So I'm saying use WordPress as your one solution, but there's not only one way to use it. I mean, you can use self-hosted WordPress on Bluehost. You can use self-hosted WordPress on SiteGround. You can use, hell, you can use self-hosted WordPress on Liquid Web like I have with a dedicated server that's $500 a month. Don't do that. Beginners don't need to spend that much money and it's just, it's not mission critical. I would never lead you down that path. There's no reason for anybody to spend more than 60 to $80 a year, less than $5 a month to have a good blog platform that they can make money with. The thing that everyone's getting suckered into is all these free blog sites where people will say, you know, oh, we'll blog on Medium and try to leverage the Medium authority and it won't cost anything. And, you're never gonna fucking make any money, man. Number one, you're not invested. Number two, you're not building something for yourself. 
You need to get your own domain name. If you really wanna make money and you really wanna have an impact and you really wanna build something that could be a business and support you and your family and ditch the nine to five, support you with a six figure income and actually grow into something substantial, you need to do it the right way. And the right way is to build something for yourself not for some other fucking company or for some other business owner. I mean, you might as well just go get another job and make some other somebody else rich. Like, I get so frustrated with this stuff because people are being cheap beyond belief. And by cheap, I mean they won't pay $5 a month to have their own address on the internet. Mine is cleverleverage.com. Mine is mattjustice.com. Mine, you know, these are names, brands that can be grown into substantial assets that can pay for my entire lifestyle. I have location independence and financial freedom because of this blog, because of this YouTube channel, because I don't use a free blog hosting site and I figured out how to do it for myself and I'm gonna show you how to do it too. As always, if you have other questions that weren't answered in this video or you have a question that you'd like answered in next week's video, let me know in the YouTube comments and be really specific. I'll see you next week.